Hello, and welcome to my home bar cart. Today, we are looking at three beloved cocktail recipes that I think everybody should know how to make. These aren't necessarily like the best cocktails you must know how to, they, but these are the ones that we make the most often when we have people over that people seem to enjoy the most. Although, <sighs> Also, you should, you should subscribe to this channel. If you like the outdoors, mountains, bourbon, tobacco, tobacco, and uh, questions about life in general, obstacles we face every day. Anyways, you should, you should subscribe because that makes the YouTube channel do better. So we're gonna be looking at three different cocktails. They're gonna be with three different types of alcohol. Uh, bourbon or whiskey, gin, and oh, should we do tequila or vodka? Maybe we'll do four. Maybe we'll do those four. That'd be cool. What would I title the video? I don't know, we'll figure it out. Okay, so the first cocktail we're gonna go over is the most classic. It's actually the first cocktail, I think, and is my personal favorite cocktail, and that is the Old Fashioned. I, um, I don't I don't actually have an orange I have a cutie a clementine a one of these so but this will work just fine it's citrusy it's delicious the old-fashioned doesn't really require many ingredients that you won't probably already have in your house except for the bitters you can use all kinds of different bitters I this this is the most traditional it's the angust angostura angostra how do you say that angostura. Holy cow. Anyways, I also love this one. This one is delicious in old fashions also. I'm just gonna show you the way that I like to make the old fashioned. It's pretty dang simple, so. You need some kind of bourbon. You will use this one. This is Bell Mead. So we'll use this, and we'll use a cocktail glass, and we'll use this measure thing. Bitters and orange. And I'm telling you, if it's, it's the best. There is one more ingredient that I totally forgot, and that is uh, a sweetener of some sort. Some people say you put a lump of sugar down there. Uh, you can use honey. My wife makes her own simple syrup using just brown sugar. I'm gonna make a sweetener. Like, just enough sugar to kind of saturate. Nope. Just enough water to kind of cover the sugar, and then you stick it in the microwave or boil, whatever you want to do. Make another cocktail. I don't have any gin. I was just gonna make a gin and tonic. It's really simple. It's like <sighs> it's like one part gin to like two parts uh, tonic water or even ginger ale or something like that. Okay, let's actually make another cocktail though. <sighs> the the crowd favorite around for us that everybody just seems to love and it's the simplest cocktail is just a simple Moscow Mule. So let's make a Moscow Mule. So I probably should have gone shopping before I did this video because it seems like I don't have any ginger beer. So I'm gonna try something new. I'm gonna try ginger ale because we have ginger ale. Might be gross, but I'm gonna try it. Just pretend it's the same thing. I don't have ginger beer. So I'm gonna make it with ginger ale. Just pretend it's ginger beer because that's what you should be using. Also, uh, if you don't have one of those copper Moscow Mule mugs, it's okay. I used to have tons of them and they all got kind of gross after a while. Like they just kind of stained up and didn't look so good anymore. So we threw them all out. I need to get more, but if you don't have one, just use any glass, it doesn't matter. Pretty dang good. The last cocktail for the day is uh, with 
Where is it? Uh, we're gonna make from scratch margaritas. Everybody likes a margarita. They are delicious, but most people use margarita mixes and those are ugh, nasty. Don't use a margarita mix. That's cheating and it's gross. Make it from scratch. It's so much better and so simple. you make when you get fat and out of shape. Yeah. It's so dang good. The other thing that we typically do when we're making these for real, and I should have done this for this because I was making them for real, is uh, use a cocktail shaker. If you make your cocktails differently, let me know in the comments. I'm curious, what is your go-to favorite cocktail and how do you make it? If you put your recipe in the comments, I might do another video coming up with your recipe. It'd be fun to try. If you want more videos like this, um, tell me so in the comments. Also like the video and subscribe to the channel because those are the things you have to say at the end of a YouTube video because YouTube wants those things and I want those things so that more people can watch these videos and that's the only way it happens is if YouTube's like, yeah, people like this because they liked it and they commented and they shared it and uh, they subscribe to the channel. So those are the things that you, I, I'd love for you to do, please. All right, that's it. Goodbye. Thank you.